There is a virus that infects almost every child in the world by the age of five, in every country, rich and poor. It affects the stomach and intestines, causing severe diarrhea and vomiting. Improvements in hygiene, sanitation, and drinking water cannot completely prevent it. It is highly contagious and spreads easily from person to person, and it can survive on surfaces for long periods of time. We have safe and effective vaccines for this virus. And yet, without ready access to those vaccines, hundreds of thousands of children die each year, and the virus hospitalizes millions more. It's called rotavirus, and it's the leading cause of severe diarrhea in children worldwide. The good news is we have made incredible progress in battling rotavirus, saving lives, improving child health, and reducing healthcare costs by improving access to rotavirus vaccines around the world. In 2006, two new oral rotavirus vaccines were tested and approved for use in the US, Europe, and Latin America. Scientific studies followed in low-income countries in Africa and Asia and pointed to the impact that rotavirus vaccines could have throughout the world. As a result, in 2009, the World Health Organization recommended that rotavirus vaccines should be given to children in all countries. The rollout of the vaccines has been incredible. In less than 10 years, more than 75 countries have introduced rotavirus vaccines as part of routine childhood immunization. Nearly half of these have been in lower income countries with financial support from Gavi, the Vaccine Alliance. It is the fastest scale up of a childhood vaccine ever. And it marks the first time that a new vaccine was introduced simultaneously in rich and poor countries. The problem is, rotavirus vaccines still aren't reaching all children. Some countries don't yet understand the heavy toll of rotavirus diarrhea, and others are struggling to find the funding in their health budgets. And as with most health services, it is always a challenge to reach children that live far from health clinics and where transportation and infrastructure are difficult. Global interest and demand for these vaccines is high, they are working in the Americas and Europe and in Africa, where more than half of all countries have introduced rotavirus vaccines. While Africa has the highest burden of diarrhea and death from rotavirus, this burden is dropping following introduction of rotavirus vaccines. We are seeing dramatic results in countries like Malawi and South Africa, where children who are vaccinated are 60% less likely to be hospitalized for rotavirus. Unfortunately, Many Asian countries have not yet introduced the vaccine, despite a heavy toll of rotavirus disease. We need to reach more children in Asia and continue the momentum in Africa. We need more supply to meet the high demand for these life-saving vaccines. Vaccine manufacturers in emerging economies have a huge potential to help develop the next generation of rotavirus vaccines, leading to lower costs and wide availability. By making this vaccine available and affordable, and combining it with other prevention and treatment methods, hospitalizations and deaths among young children due to diarrhea will continue to fall. Look at the amazing speed with which we've been able to bring rotavirus vaccines to children all over the world. There are still so many children that need this vaccine. Help us share this story so we can protect all children from rotavirus. To learn more, Visit defeatdd.org and path.org and join us on Facebook and Twitter.